Ari, Jordi Prepper here, and just a quick video because I didn't really get many preps in the month of September. The prep that I was really low on was uh, sodium bicarbonate, and mostly at the minute I'm just using this for cleaning. But I did get some years ago because I knew the potential of sodium bicarbonate before I was even a prepper. Um, I did get many years ago this book here. I'll try and find it on Amazon uh, or somewhere. Uh, and give you a link to it. But basically this just goes through some of the hundreds of household uses for sodium bicarbonate. And if you're a prepper, you definitely want quite a bit of this stuff on hand because basically I think this stuff here is probably one of the most underrated and probably one of the most overlooked preps um, that anyone uh, considers really um, it's got such a huge range of uses it's really incredible stuff um, even if you just look at the, the 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 contents of this book you know what it basically goes through you can use it for it's just a massive range um, cleaning obviously kitchen bathroom furnishings and surfaces uh, you can use it on your pets as well which is good uh, you can use it for laundry cleaning personal care and hygiene, health, it's basically, this is what people were using before, um, you know, commercial toothpaste was out, uh, and it's what I use at the minute, you know, it's perfectly, perfectly adequate and good for your teeth. Um, you can use it for maintenance on your tools, you can use it in gardening, uh, you can use it on your vehicles, uh, you can create kids projects, stuff for kids to do. If um, grid goes down, stuff hits the fan. Occupying kids is going to take up a lot of time for some people. So, you know, even just this, you know, you can do something with it for kids. And you can use it in food as well. Um, you can see from this package in here, this company, uh, Intralabs. It's the company that I always get this sort of things from. Um, they just provide the best quality and they deliver it so quick. That's, I mean, they're not sponsoring the video, so... Um, but it's just it just happens to be the company that I get it from because they do just do such a good service. Um, it's premium food grade, um, sodium bicarbonate, fine powder, aluminium and gluten free. So you can use it on your food and uh, no worries. Um, it's called by many different names depending on um, what continent and country that you're in really. But um, I'll just go through some of them. Uh, bicarbonate of soda. Sodium bicarbonate, that's what this company calls it. Uh, bicarb, it's known as basic baking soda, especially if you're American. Um, bread soda, sodium bicarbonate, saleratus, or you can even call it sodium hydrogen carbonate, which I'm supposing is a scientific name. Um, but yeah, basically the only thing I really use it for at the minute is cleaning. Um, it's literally the only thing, one of the only things that I use. The only other thing I use at the minute is bleach, just a dilute solution of bleach. And I use uh, sodium bicarbonate with um, citric acid crystals to clean my water distiller. And also you'll notice that this, this came in a sealed uh, vacuum sealed package. It never used to come in a package like that. It used to come in a package like this. You can see this is from the same company. Uh, this was bought many months ago. But they used to come in like a sealed packaging, so which you can open and then reseal again. Uh, this one hasn't came in that. And I'm thinking maybe that they've changed their packaging. This is a lot more compact, so you can store it better. But just something to consider, guys, when you get preps is even though you might buy from the exact same company, the exact same product, the packaging may change over time. So that might affect how you store it. And it might also mean that you need to buy other sort of container or packaging to accommodate that prep. Because the packaging, so I could use this. I could buy the product and I could use this bag, open it, take the product out, reseal it, no, no problem, bish bosh. And then it comes in this. Uh, if I open it, I can't keep it in this packaging. So it's good in one way because I can store it better because it's it's just better packaged like this. But in another way, 
I've now got to get something else to store it in. So what I'm probably gonna do is just get like some um, some jars, um, you know, that you use in a kitchen to store products in. So yeah, bicarbonate soda guys, um, if you're a prepper and you're bugging in, I would definitely suggest that you get at least five kilograms of this stuff. So get five kilograms minimum, keep it on hand, but also get a educational book, something which can teach you how to use it. Because I mean, just, just look how thick this book is. I mean, these pages are just crammed with just uses for one thing, <laughs> bicarbonate of soda. I mean, I, al I already knew that it had multiple uses before I bought the book, but when I got the book and I seen how thick it was, I was like, whoa. But uh, yeah, I mean, I'm only using it for cleaning in my teeth at the minute, but obviously there's so much more you can get out of it. And if you're a prepper, I would suggest that you just get some on hand. So, I mean, that's it, guys. That's all I really just wanted to talk about. Just some things to maybe consider as well. Um, so that's it. That's been me, Jordy Prepper. Uh, I make videos on being prepared. Just simple, basic things. And I'm just keeping it simple. Just talking about how I prep, which can hopefully make uh, you prep a little better. All right. So take care. And I'll see you in the next video. Ari, Geordie Prepper here. I hope you liked the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment and subscribe and share the video too if you did. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down and some constructive feedback is always welcomed. The Preppers Discord server is always available to talk to myself and other preppers about prepping and other relevant topics. My other social media is on screen now. You can follow me there and I usually just use it to post when new videos are available. Don't forget to be safe and be prepared and also check your preps.